People in Santa Rosa being told to be ready for possible evacuations. Last year's glass fire left many areas susceptible to mudslides. NBC Barrios, Jody Hernandez. She's live in Santa Rosa, where folks are bracing for a touch and go night. Jody. That's right, Janelle. Folks here in Sonoma County are definitely on high alert. We're in the Skyhawk Park neighborhood of Santa Rosa, an area that got hit hard by the glass fire. I don't know if you can see this burned out house behind us. Now, many of these homes we're going to pan down here are now surrounded by these swaddles here to protect them from any kind of debris flow. Folks here have evacuated several times before because of fire, but never faced the potential of evacuating because of rain. It's hard to believe that another big climate event is upon us. Beth Philp once again has her irreplaceable items boxed up and ready to go. Philp's house narrowly escaped the glass fire as it swept through her neighborhood last year. But now it's rain that's threatening her home. We feel worried for the hills behind us that there's a uh, lot still to be cleared and the hills are fairly burnt and that the, the landslides could happen in, in, in the hills behind us. We're expecting potentially over an inch an hour of rain uh, in about a two, three hour window of time. So for us, that's concerning. The Santa Rosa Fire Department says the glass fire left hillsides charred and unsettled, and a severe downpour could cause the soil to slip. There absolutely is the potential that if we do have an incident here locally, that there may be evacuations that take place. City crews have closed off trails at risk of mudslides and flooding. They've also given out free waddles so people can shore up their property in the burn zone. And today, the fire department went door to door, urging residents to be on their toes. Having your cell phones charged, ready to receive an emergency alert overnight, and have your bag packed, especially if you live in the burn scar or immediately around it. Beth Philp says the storm is top of mind, and her family is bracing for whatever challenges it brings. Well, I think we've learned to, to take what comes when it comes. Now, waddles are also set up on the streets, as you can see right here, to protect the storm drains and keep them from flooding. Again, folks here are on high alert. The Emergency Operations Center will be up and running here throughout the night. They say have your phones charged, be ready. If there are any problems, you will get an alert. Reporting live in Santa Rosa, I'm Jody Hernandez, NBC Bay Area News.